Medio border of the scapula, lateral border of the scapula, high point of the humerus, and in through here is where we're going to have trigger points if we've got them. And you can feel that band. You can mm -hmm. see me flicking over there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm going to feel the other side. Anything through there? Not much? Not much. Okay. So we would expect that it should be stiff through these guys. And that feels quite stiff to me. Does it feel? Yeah, it's a little tender. Yeah. Um, we're also thinking that another point that we can notice is that when they go along the sides of the neck, that this side should be fairly loose where the other side which is the side that's involved in the spiral line quite often will be a bit sore and tight. Feedback? Yes, correct. Okay, cool. So that's giving us a tick, tick, tick and tick. Oh there you go, see there all like, there it says contralateral spiral joints, stiff and tender, stiff painful spinous process. There you go. So I didn't have to look at your book, it was right there. So I'm going to make the rhomboid do some exercise. We've got two ways we can do it. We can get the clients to stand up and do it as homework. Um, or if they're on the table and you're doing work, you can just get in and, and do some stuff here. Sometimes this is a bit like that. Mm -hmm. So it's easier just to get them up off the table and do exercise. But what we're going to do is just relax that arm. I'm going to get her to elevate this elbow really lightly so that without going this direction, we're going to come up and down in that way. So I'm actually lifting so she gets an idea of the movement. And I want to put my fingers on the rhomboids to actually feel that they're doing something. So a little tiny lift for me. And down. That's too high. A little lift. Whoop. And down. And a little lift. And down. Now the important thing here is the relax between the lift. Yeah? A little tiny lift. And down. I actually feel that my hips want to go. Mm. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is, it, which really is showing us our, our spiral line. Yeah. The lift, and, and that's why I say low. So if you lift high, lift up for me. You'll get, you'll get a, a swaying going on there. A little lift, and down. What we want to stop them from doing is, is coming into abduction because we're going to be working up a trapezius. We don't want that. We just want a pure lift. If they look like their shoulder, their humerus is coming in, they're working deeper into the, they're working in rotator cuff. So in that instance, I'll say, I want you to feel like the elbow is coming away, up and away, like, like there's someone next to you that you want to elbow versus that movement in and out. Okay. So if they've got really tight. Up, that, will, that will try that to lift, yeah. yeah. Because those are all trying to do the job of the rhomboid. Because remember, task focus, the body will keep going. The body will do whatever it can to perform a task. Relax it, relax it, relax it. That's not relaxed yet. That's not relaxed yet. Yes, that's relaxed. And a little tiny lift. And down and relax. And a little tiny lift. So there's a bit of brain power going on there for the client, mm -hmm. but 20 of them normally is enough. Don't let the shoulder move, think about the elbow. Elbow. Middle. Two more. Don't let that yeah. shoulder depress. <laughs> See? Yeah. yeah. It's automatically went into. That would mean it's getting weak. She's getting, getting tired. Yeah. Getting tired. Yeah. And uh, we're going to assess this. How's it feeling now? Much nicer. Yeah. So that is. Yeah, that's much nicer. Yeah, less tension. Yeah, that feels a lot softer through there. And that feels softer through there too. How's that feeling to you? Yeah, less tension. Okay, if you want to hop up and have a poke with your cherries and tell me if it feels really easy to you. <laughs> yeah, much. Yeah. Mm. So their homework 
which is the other way you could say, I want you to try that one and then try the homework. Come over with me, over here.